How to go from this to this. Stick around and I'll tell you. Is it worth it? Like I said, let's find out. It is almost time. I have actually got a schedule for our DoorDash and I am going to see. It says that it is busy. If y'all can see that, let me do a screenshot so you can see it. And I was scheduled from 4 to 11. Uh, very busy out at Shepherd Air Force Base and it's showing that it is busy here in Wichita Falls. My acceptance rating went to 100 because I did just a short, I turned it on at a random time and I took the first order that came up and I took this, well, here's the first order and here's the second order. But either way, that got my acceptance rate to 100. So let's see if we get good orders. Now that my acceptance ratings are acceptable. Well, I'm going to hit dash now. I'm actually doing Walmart Spark. I'm going to go ahead and hit dash now. I've got the screen recording going, so let's check it out. And let's see if it really makes a difference. Hot bag, red card. I guess I got my red card. I haven't even looked in a while. Which probably ought to check, but either way. Enough gas. Yes, we got three quarters of a tank. Charge phone, yeah, it's sitting at 89%, but I have my phone charger. Start dashing. Let's see what happens. You're getting, oh, 625 for 10.2 miles. Now, I hate to start off immediately by declining an order. high priority huh. all right you know what just for video's sake and uh and to see i'm gonna go ahead and hit accept that is too many miles for too less to pay and i highly suggest you not take orders like that but in this case i'm going to so let's go to Cadoba and pick it up I will say this will probably be the uh, only order that I take that is this low. And the, the pay wouldn't be bad if it was close, but did y'all see those miles? 10.2 miles, I believe it was. That's ridiculous. But I took it. Just for you. Let's go see uh, if it's ready. Look at this. What could that possibly be? Oh, it's a little bitty. Do they have fruit cups or something at Cadoba? That's what it feels like. They're paying, no telling what, to have this delivered 10 miles. The price on it is $1.68. Wait a minute, uh, DoorDash total, $1.68. People have lost their minds. Oh, I see what it is. Uh, it is ro roasted tomato salsa, mild, a four ounce container. That's wanting some salsa awful bad. <laughs> oh, y'all look at that. If you can't see it, here's a screenshot right here. The base pay was $5.25. Customer tip one dollar for a total of six dollars and twenty-five cents for a ten point two miles, I think it was. But anyway, let me pull over up here and we will uh I'll just do a screenshot because I won't bore you with me just talking to drive. So we're at uh one hundred percent and uh completion rate ninety-five on time ninety-three eighty-six. All that was from previous times but uh 
and see what happens if we when it, we do decline one because the next one I get I'm going to decline it and let's see what it does to our ratings okay so y'all stand by and wait for it I just got a uh, DoorDash in let's see uh, six seventy five plus 4.6 miles from Q's, which is a uh, restaurant nearby. I'm going to go ahead and accept it, so we'll just see what it does. So I guess that means it's going to get 675 or more. Let's go find out. Well, I'm not sure how that uh, other, that decline affected my rating because I was gonna do a screenshot and a little bit of video, but that other order just popped right in and I didn't get a chance to. Let's look at ratings. Wow. 83% for dropping one order. I had taken all these other ones, as you saw. One order, dropped it. 17 percent having to take a short break from doordash so i can actually make some money have to jump over and do spark for a minute i'll resume doordash in just a few moments but from what i've seen that uh, reset has done a zero good doordash is still door trash in my market in my opinion others have different opinions but that's mine but we will see i'm not giving up quite yet here we go 9.50 okay that's a decent order oh no wait that's two orders uh, well still 2.8 miles so two orders was that four 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 seventy five at each all right let's take it not terribly bad not great but not terribly bad. Hopefully they have it ready. So this is your high paying orders for uh, the high acceptance rating. $2. That's your high paying orders. Oh my, okay. On to the next drop, that was two orders. I'm gonna go take the other pizzas. Okay, the second delivery was a high pan DoorDash order there. Another two dollars. Luckily the customer tipped the 350, made it 550. That this I don't know folks. This reset seems to be a joke to me. I don't know. I have not seen any benefits. Except my acceptance rating is back to 88%. Is it going off again? Oh, that must be a spark order. Because I got spark running too. But, it, you know, everybody or some people are making that reset sound so great. And DoorDash is trying to make it sound so great. But in the first few hours, um... Don't expect nothing any different. You can get those same exact orders with 13% acceptance rating. That is a fact. I have no screenshots to prove it. All I have is my, my honest word to prove it. So, or not really prove it, but my honesty. Y'all just ain't gonna have to believe me. When I could get on DoorDash. And that may be the biggest difference. Is maybe you'll be able to get on DoorDash more easily. And by the have heard some people say they have top dasher status and no longer can get on the Dash Now or Dash Anytime, however it's worded. So I don't know, folks. You can do what you want, but so far, this has proven to me pretty much what I kind of figured it would be. 
but I had hopes that maybe there would be some decent orders coming out. And I'm not into the, I don't know, I'm not talking about the large order program and uh, whatever other kinds of garbage they got going. I don't know. Uh, I know the large order program because I hear people talking about, you know, UDM and all those folks. Everybody's talking about that. But uh, as far as just resetting your acceptance rating and getting that 100%, it looks pretty. When you look at it, oh, it looks pretty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it makes a zero difference. And that's a fact. I believe we can all attest to that from what I have shown you so far. Unless something changes. And I've taken some garbage orders in hopes that, because I had heard that if you take two or three of the garbage orders, then that fourth one's going to be a good one. <laughs> oh, well, maybe so in some markets. Um, Y'all are seeing it. Door dash is still door trash. And it's no offense to y'all that really love DoorDash because it may be fantastic in your market. That's a red light. Oop, my bad. I can't fuss at Pedro about rolling through stop signs when I roll through red lights, can I? And it was actually yellow when I went under it. But uh, anyway, I know some of y'all really enjoy DoorDash and it's really good in your market and that's great. I, I, I wished it was here, but it's been garbage for the last year, well, yeah, for about the last year, year and a half, and uh, it, uh, for me, personally, it doesn't seem that it has changed whatsoever. Let's wait and see what else comes up before it gets dark 30. All right, y'all check it out. Kung Fu Kitchen, 550 for 2.6 miles. I guess we will take it. Well, I don't know if y'all can still see me. It's starting to get kind of dark here. That last order, I was going to do a screenshot. And right when I started to do the screenshot, it popped up for this order right here. It's at uh, some kind of, I don't know. It's, it's at Chili's, but I guess Chili's has a new ghost kitchen. I, I don't know. You know, I, I was just talking to Emily, and it's like I had said a few moments ago, if you take two $6 orders going 2.2 miles, that's 4.4 miles for $12. On a spark order, it could be anywhere from well, now they're getting cheaper, but on average, up until this past few weeks, it could be around 19 to $24 with the same mileage. So double the money. And if it's a shopping order, you could be tripling the money. I'm going to, I'm going to wrap this video. Well, no. I'm going to stop it here because it just switched and I don't, I can see myself, but it doesn't look real clear, but I'm going to, uh, probably wrap this video up when I get home and, uh, we'll go over some numbers and final thoughts, but I don't think if you're a DoorDash fan, I don't think you're going to like the final thoughts. So you might want to just push stop on this video now. And if you're interested, stick around. I'll, I'm not going to be as technical as some people like how much I'm, how many miles I went. I don't know. I didn't. I started my tracker when I left the house, and I did spark for a couple of hours before I started DoorDash. So I can guesstimate. I don't know. I'll try to figure it out and get y'all some kind of ballpark figure. But I can tell you right now. This uh, resetting your acceptance rating is a joke. There ain't no two ways about it. Anyway, 
I'll see y'all at the office at home. Okay, so what we wound up with was 46.25. Um, it says one hour and 53 minutes active time. But actually, it was probably about three and a half hours. I don't know. I guess that's the time that you're actually on an order. But uh, I paused. Five hours and two minutes was the total time. But I had paused it quite a bit during the spark orders. The base pay on the majority of these were $2 on uh, stacked orders and two fifty dollars on single orders. I had one order that had a base pay of five twenty-five, dollars so it probably must have set for a while. I'm not real sure what brought that one up, but regardless, out of all that time, I think we calculated it was how many how much was it per order five five seventy eight per order and out of eight eight deliveries eight orders forty six twenty five for about three and a half hours i think that came out like thirteen dollars an hour if you want to do the hours i don't calculate hours but if you're going to there you go now you can argue the facts they will use only active delivering for an hour and 53 minutes you're out there so you know it is what it is you can you can sugarcoat it any way you want to but facts are facts i was out five hours and made 46.25 off of doordash well out of the three hours the three to three and a half hours 46.25 because like i said i paused it i was doing spark orders and if you know, want to see something funny i mean really the uh, for what I made here, there was a twenty-six dollar. If you can see that, twenty-six dollars for two orders going three miles on the spark. So I made half of the entire time on DoorDash. I made half of it in one spark order. It's hard to argue that, you know, facts are facts. So, overall, my thoughts on the acceptance rating making a difference? Absolutely not. I seen nothing. DoorDash is even worse than what it was when I quit doing DoorDash. And it don't look uh, like it's going to get any better and like i said earlier this is not counting the, that large order program and those other shady programs that doordash has started to try to pull the wool over people's eyes you can do whatever you want to do as long as you're making money and you can call it however you want to call it but when it all boils down to you got to do what makes you money and uh yeah, you can make a little money on DoorDash, but you're also going to be putting a lot of miles on your car. That's about all I got on that. I don't know that, uh, oh, well, I did, let's see, let's see what I ended up with on my rating. And I did decline two. And remember, I started off at 100%, and I declined to 83%. So... These was eight deliveries, and I did two deliveries on the 20th when the reset took place. So 10 deliveries and drop two, and I'm at 83%. Made no difference on the dollar amount, though. Well, that's that. That's all I got. Y'all can uh, do it if you want to. Maybe it'll be different and better for y'all. Who knows? It's not for me. You know, if you're smiling, dashing, dancing, prancing, doing whatever it is you want to do, just keep doing something because you're going to grow old if you don't. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, y'all.